This is a short descriptive video of a non a flip clock this time. So yeah, you might be slightly amazed, but I'm not a, a fan of only flip clocks. I am a fan of mostly flip clocks. Uh, I do sometimes come across clocks that I find so very cool that I have to have them. I have to buy them. And this one was one of them. I'd actually never seen one before. It reminds me of an Ixitu clock. It also reminds me of a LumiTime clock. You clock lovers out there will know what it is. If not, Google it and you will fall in love. By the way, there is one for sale in my shop at the moment, so don't wait too long because I only have one. Um, this clock um, has a mechanism on the inside which um, um, Kind of not the, the Lumi Time clock has all of these lights inside, and there's a mechanism inside which covers or uncovers the lights as to show you the correct time. And this one is slightly different. There's two lights left and right, one for the hours, one for the minutes. Uh, on the inside, the lights have been replaced by me. Uh, uh, by the way, by brand new ones. They were very hard to find because they were very special lamps, uh, but they're brand new. And um, there's a mechanism which um, kind of reveals the, the let's call them sticks or, or the, um, the bars which reveals the right, the right ones as to show you the correct time. Uh, however you'd like to call it, if you catch my drift, if you know what I mean. It's, it's very intricate and, and slightly complicated, um, but it is working perfectly. And I feel it has a very vintage space age feel to it, especially also the housing, which reminds you of the Bakelite, which it is not. It's plastic with sort of a matte finish on it. That's why I didn't really polish it. I just cleaned it because I was afraid I would take off the matte finish by polishing it. Um, this clock is quite rare. It's a German clock, German make, German brand. Uh, it also says, you know, the alarm. An um, aus uh, Alarm. Und den Zeit man einstellen kann. I speak a little bit of German. Um, so let me turn on the alarm. If you turn it on, there's the light there. Uh, yeah. So did I mention it's loud? Um, so yeah, I mean, I, 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 either you like your loud your your alarm clocks loud, or you just use it as a normal clock. I think it is really, really, really cool and uh, therefore I uh, allowed it to become part of my um, um, ever-changing collection and to become um, a member of my shop um, uh, in spite of the fact that it's not a flip clock. Uh, you will be seeing more of that in the future because, um, you know, uh, I'm not getting bored with flip clocks, don't worry. I just like to expand and sometimes I see something that is so cool and so kind of close to a flip clock because it's from the same era. Um, so it's just different and probably um, it was expensive to make, it was expensive to buy back then as opposed to a flip clock which you could buy you know for the equivalent of brand new uh, let's say 20, 30 euros maybe, not even. Um, what more can I say about it? As I said, two brand new lights on the inside, new cable, new plug um, the mechanism was lubricated. I will supply with the clock an extra set of these lamps should they ever burn out. I don't expect they will do so in the next 20-25 years, but I will still supply with an extra set of two lights free of charge. Any questions let me know. For sale in my Etsy shop and thank you for watching.